Bicol region is one of the most famous tourist spots here in the Philippines, which is widely known for its spicy foods, festive festivals, and tall and breathtaking mountains like of course the majestic Mount Mayon. But some may be unaware that there is also a mountain here in Bicol region which is smaller, part of the Magayon Trio, and also contributes to the tourism here in Bicol region, and that is Mount Masaraga. Mount Masaraga has an elevation of 1,328 meters and one of the country's remaining forest reserve. Mount Masaraga has also a rich and diverse flora, fauna, and shockingly, abe fauna. Birds are sustainers of other forms of life as they are one of the best pollinating agents for various plants. Similarly, most bird species are insectivores and efficiently control insect pests in agriculture and horticulture. For short, birds play an important role in conserving the ecosystem of Mount Maserga. This study was specifically held in Barangays Amtik and Herrera Ligao City for us to have a preliminary knowledge about the abundance and endemicity of avian species observed here in the vicinity of the mountain, and also to help formulate ideas in conserving them. Three sites were identified and labeled as disturbed, less disturbed, and no disturbance, which was given two days each to gather data. Photographs, record of calls, and direct identification were the methodologies used to gather data. Opportunistic sampling was also used throughout the study. A total of 38 abifaunal species within 26 families and 36 genera were found and identified with the family Columbidae being the most dominant with 6 species and Laneus and Streptopilia being the richest genera having 2 species each. Overall, a total of 787 individuals were identified and classified. However, it was noted that the endemism was low at only 21.05%, meaning most birds found in the area are non-endemic. Also, based on the data, the more disturbed the area are the lesser species we can observe, especially endemic species, which were mostly observed on less or undisturbed areas. And with the rise of the industries, it is not far away for these undisturbed places to be disturbed that would likely have an impact on the population of avian species. With the help of this study and further actions from each one of us, reaching our goal to help and conserve these species is possible. Remember that we are not just saving the birds, but also the environment itself. And with the help of us, these birds could have a better and fresher tomorrow. Let's save the birds.